Hey guys, welcome to Kidview YouTuber channel. I'm James, a support engineer of Kidview. The voice communication system is very important in the production process of radio and TV programs, and sometimes even affect the quality of the entire production program. Kidview KS Pro, a multi-part voice call system, can perfectly help you solve these problems. Today, we will show you how to deploy the KIS Pro system. We can log into the system through the terminal application of Ubuntu. Uh, first, we need to obey the permissions of the current Ubuntu system. Enter the command through the through and then enter the password of the Ubuntu system. OK, step 1, instead Docker. We can copy this line of command and pass it into the terminal. If your server already has Docker instead, you can skip this step. OK, step 2. Download the KIS Pro Docker image. Continue to enter the commands, or you can copy and pass them again. OK, step 3. Run the KS Pro container. Because there are many command characters, it is recommended that you copy this command directly to the terminal window. This line of command indicates that the container is started and running. And its name is KIS server. Network model is hostess model. Authorization requirement. Automatically run after reboot. Finally, execute the deployment sprint. At this point, all deployment operations are complete. We can try to log into the KIS Pro to check whether the deployment is successful. Enter HTTPS and the server IP. In the address of the browser, and press Enter to display the log interface of KIS Pro. The default username is admin, and the password is admin as well. Alright, thank you for watching. 
If you want to know more about KS Pro, feel free to contact support team. See you next time.